Hi, my name is Christina, and today we are going to be talking about breastfeeding. I just became a mom, and I wish I knew this information before, but you know, I'm learning, and now I'm gonna share what I've learned. So everything I'll be talking about in this video, I will uh, clip the links for them, so it will make your life easier. So enjoy the video, and let's get it started. So when we are delivering a baby on the third day, well, approximately on the third day, uh, the milk comes. And then your boobs become from this small to this big. So a friend of mine gave me the bra that she used and it was huge. So I looked at it, put it in my head and I'm like, uh, what do I do with it? So rule number one, take it because your boobs will be three times bigger. So, you know, just get ready that your boobs will be enormous because I went from 32C to 32 double G's. Yep, I know. Okay, so if you are going to use the breast milk pump, uh, it looks like this and you know, we attach the bottle. So at first I was like holding them with my hands and I did not know that there is a breast pump bra. Oh my God, it's like a lifesaver. You put it on, I mean, I know it looks funny, but then you have this holes where you can put the attachments and then your hands would be free while you pumping. Isn't it awesome? Because if you don't have this pumping bra, then you're going to stand like this and, you know, your hands are busy and then you are busy for, I don't know, 20, 30 minutes. So, yeah. And let me show you something. You see? You see? I'm pumping and then I can record myself. Or I can do the skincare routine or I can do something else. But still, my hands are free. Okay, the next thing you need to know is the nipple cream. Trust me, you need it because when you start breastfeeding, it doesn't have to hurt you and it will not hurt you on the third or fourth day. The first couple of days, your nipples are adjusting and to help them to do so, you need the nipple cream for that. So if you will choose to pump the milk, you would need the breast milk storage bags. The ones that I had is from Lancinol company, but you can use any of them. I would suggest use the BPA free now. Uh, I'll put the link for that below. You can reuse those uh, and it's very convenient. You put the date and the time when you did take the milk, uh, well, when you produce the milk and then um, you put the milk over there and then you can put it in the freezer and please remember it's a different time that you can store the milk in the fridge or in the freezer itself so as you can see it's pretty easy you put the date time you zip it up you put how many milliliters are there and then you just put it in the freezer you can store it up to six months so now when the milk comes, you might have this tightened feelings in your breasts. So the warm shower will be helping you to release it. And you can also do a quick massage. Uh, it's a quick movement. So you just go round and then, you know, it does release the tension um, on your boobs. Uh -huh. Well, this is all new for me too. <laughs> so, you know, yeah, they're huge. Now, uh, nursing pads. You've probably watched the movies where the woman comes out of the room and she has milk all over her nipples. So if you want to avoid it, I do recommend using the cotton um, breast pads. They're very soft. Do not get the ones that are not cotton because otherwise it will hurt your nipples and the nipples do become very sensitive as you might know already. Okay, now there are so many different bottles on the market. I use the one that's uh, the name of it is mom and the size zero it does have different sizing and the sizing does tell you what would be the flow here's the bottle you know I loved it my daughter loved it this bottle was perfect for us so if you have other you know life hacks for the breastfeeding leave the comments below because I would feel so much better if I knew that you know there is a bra uh, when you pump or that there are pads that you can use that will not make your nipples go crazy. That your boobs will go so much bigger than they are nowadays, even when you're pregnant. So yeah, it was nice having you. Bye. Thank you. And thank you for watching. Kiss you.